Is there uh, any sort of ceremony? Uh, I know there's, I'm sure, a ceremony, but, and maybe you're not allowed to say, but any uh, tradition of how you greet a new justice? You know, um, is there any hazing? Uh, <laughs> do you, uh, <laughs> is there any, are there any practical jokes? Is there anything that's, that's, that's done? No, we don't do practical You don't well, do practical jokes. Certain, there, there are certain traditions. Mm -hmm. The first one is, that when someone's nominated, the justice who sit um, don't typically reach out to the nominee. Mm -hmm. I, I presume that might be different if you're very close friends with them. Right. But if um, you only know them somewhat in passing, the tradition is not to reach out to them right. until after the confirmation process. And after the Senate confirmed me, um, I received calls from almost all of my then colleagues, mm -hmm. um, our colleagues to be. Um, the first was from the chief judge and then other calls followed. Um, how justices welcome you to the court varies among the justices. So when I came aboard, for example, Justice Stevens and Justice O'Connor came to visit me. Um, and, uh, and that was wonderful. Mm -hmm. uh, when Justice Barrett came to the court, it was COVID. So I couldn't just walk over to her office and say right. hello. But I did sh shortly thereafter. Um, people call you, people send you notes. That's what Justice Ginsburg did the first day I arrived. There was a note on, um, on my desk from her and it was very sweet, welcoming me aboard and giving me a copy of her bench book, of her chamber's book. Um, oh. which basically describes how she runs her office. Right. And it was invaluable for a new justice starting out. Um, so people have different ways of welcoming each justice, but they will reach out in one way or another, either with a call or with a visit. Now, I probably shouldn't, uh, this is the kind of thing I'd be obsessed with, but if uh, Justin Stephen Breyer has been there obviously quite a bit longer, he must have a really nice office. <laughs> that office is now being vacated. Do you get to do you get to move to that office? Do you get that office? I bet he's got a really every, good office. Every, everyone <laughs> except the chief. The chief has an office that's designated just for the chief. But then they go down from the top of the seniority list and they each ask each justice in turn whether they want to move. Mm -hmm. um, I like Justice Breyer's office, but I love mine more. <laughs> So, in fact, just they had gone to the predecessor justices and asked uh -huh. me whether I wanted to move. Uh -huh. And I said, no. So I'm going to stay where I am. Well, I think you should think about that twice because uh, there's a lot of things to take into consideration. Uh, the rumor is Breyer's, uh, you know, office is pretty sweet. And it is right it's next so to, it's right next to the vending machine. And <laughs> You get your Snickers well, bar instantly. You should know that I'm on the second floor mm -hmm. of the courthouse. All my other colleagues are on the first floor. Mm -hmm. The advantage of being on the second floor is I get more sunlight in my office. Very nice. It's yeah. bigger square footage than my <laughs> colleagues. Number three, I can decorate on the walls outside my office, which they can't because they're on the historic first floor. Mm -hmm. So they can't hang anything outside their offices. And number four, they sit one after the other, mm -hmm. which means they have to be a bit quiet because they can't disturb the people on either side of them. Mm -hmm. I'm a bit loud. I like laughing. I like playing music on occasion. Mm -hmm. um, I talk loud. And so I like being on the second floor. Okay. Where I'm not bothering anybody and they can't bother me. <laughs> Have you ever gotten a call from one of the other justices to keep it down? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, I mean. Well, you know, we have on, on the first floor, we have marble ceilings. Got it. Wood, You've got that wood marble. And yeah. Yeah. And, and it keeps the noise from traveling upstairs. Yeah. We didn't have downstairs. that. I never had that growing up and neither did you. <laughs> <I didn't have laughs> <that marble. laughs> 